What's happening, YouTube? You know what time it is. Fuck you, mean. You know what I'm saying? Fuck you, mean, bro. You said what? You said black-owned companies. What? What you say? You said black on uh, what? I can take it there. <laughs> Y'all family, what's going on? You know what time it is. It is time for another product. So I was in Black Friday Market because I'm in the Raleigh Durham area. Raleigh Durham, stand up. You know what time it is. And I'm talking to my dude, Johnny. You know what I'm saying? He put me on to some, some dope product. I was looking because I didn't see it. I ain't seen it before. And so I'm in there. I'm buying some, you know, other items and, and things like that. And I was like, yo, what's this? He said, bro, those are speakers. I'm thinking to myself, I know, but who's this? And he was like, oh, they knew, man. They out of New York. And why? What's good? Stand up. Show love. Hit that like button real quick. And I was like, okay, bet. He's like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I said, well, how much are they? He's like, they're seven bucks. And I was like, at first, I was like, whoa. Clay kind of tiny looking. I was like, you know what, Vic? You are the curator of my black universe. You are the go-to person to try stuff. So people don't have to feel like they wasting their time. If anybody gonna get it, you gotta get it. I got to get it. So I was like, cool, 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 cool. Let me pick one up. And it got some weight on it. That's a nice thud, you know what I'm saying? That's a nice thud. This is real metal. So I was like, oh, that's quality. We got to draw them out. So boom, he give them to me. You see the case. You know what I'm saying? Quality sound. You see the case? I was like, I kind of like that case. Reminds me of a case for like a microphone. For all my music heads, you know what I'm saying? It's, you know, all your auxiliary cords and stuff like that. That's what it reminds me of. So, you know, you see it. It comes in the case. Case is nice. Comes with a micro USB to USB type A cord. We'll talk about that later. You get two speakers. And then they throw in on the side two little miniature pouches to carry, which, you know, at first I was like, oh. but then I understood it. Who's going to really carry this around all the time? Now, if you fly somewhere you want to have this, I understand you're going the ultimate protection for your speakers. But if you're going to the gym or you're going outside or you're going to a barbecue, you're not going to want to carry this around all the day one time. You got to keep behind. Nobody want to do all that. So I was like, you know what? I dig it. I understand. That's actually dope. The little mini character. I'm looking around for him. One second. I was like, okay. That's what's up. Speakers fit. The speakers fit perfectly in there. You see you got the little, little pocket in each one. So you can put the speaker in there. And it works. The zipper feels like quality. You know? I don't feel like it's a janky zipper. I was like, okay, dope. So I actually, I used them the first day I got them. Like, I was like, let me let me put these to the test. Let me hit them with a charge. And they actually had pretty good battery in them already, so it didn't take long to charge the maximum. And when you charge them, you'll have a blue light and a blue LED, and when they're fully charged, the LED will disappear. Boom. So I was like, cool. Let's take these downstairs and make them do what they do. And now the, the pairing process... Is a little, it's a little different. Y'all put a little more. Nah, it's not like that. So when you're pairing it, you ha have to, of course, turn on speaker. It automatically goes into pairing mode. Observe. Power on. Bluetooth already opened. Boom. So. Power off. I don't know why I go from white woman to a British woman, but uh, whatever. So it's automatically Bluetooth already open. So if you never connected to a device and you have a secondary speaker, you turn the secondary speaker on. And once it's on, 
to connect to the first speaker, that secondary speaker, you double tap that power button and they'll both connect. Boom. I was like, okay, that's dope. That's dope. In fact, Turn the volume down a little bit, just can see how how loud it gets. My black universe, and how clear these my are. Black universe, welcome to my universe. My black universe, my black universe. Let go, let go, let go. That's max volume. Very punchy sound. Ah, uh, first things first, let's stay back. Let's take a moment to take you back. Back when I was in school and it wasn't cool to buy anything from black. Like, we always wrong, black folk just can't get along. I heard until I was grown, sick and tired of that song. Then I came up with the plan, everybody would just laugh. Like, nigga, have you gone mad? Black businesses equal trash. Fuck that. Can't believe this. Here, how punchy they are. So these aren't really big um there is bass okay don't get me twisted these are these have really good bass here's the problem look at the depth of the housing so you have to think about it these are very weighty this is metal i'm, I'm pretty sure this is aluminum you got this rubber bottom which negates space you have room for your battery and your internal components for your Bluetooth uh, computer and everything like that, so these two can sync up together. So there's a lot that's in here along with the speaker. Now let's turn it real quick so you can see the speaker actually moving. Let's see if we can show you that. Make some easy play. I just want to see it spin. Damn. I'm a ride. Yes, I'm a ride. I'm a ride for my people. Now you might be able to see it, you might not be able to see it, but let's play a different song. This is a brighter song. Hey, there's nothing like a black queen. Like a black queen. You pretty melanated thing. There's nothing like a black queen. You know what I'm saying. I ain't. I ain't. You know what it is. Let go. Good morning, black queen. Girl, you're my favorite thing. For the record, I bet you that you don't know just what you mean. To me, cause what I see is hard to believe. Your black skin, the melanin, intoxicating. Your fairy tale beauty, magnificent booty. I'm taking to the other side of this room. Let's turn it up. Hold on. Hold on. They're literally on the other side of the room. Family. That's the listening test portion. Let me give you guys my verdict on these and what I what I really think about them. All right, now we got that out the way. One thing I do know about these speakers, they are directional, of course, because they're in this metal housing, which doesn't give a lot of leniency to sound going outward. You got the grill on top, so they're directional. But you can place these in a room, have them face up. They'll hit the ceiling and then kind of bounce back down. That actually works. I was in the fitness center here in this hotel. I actually took one, put it on one side of the fitness center, and put the other one on the other side of the fitness center. The latency wasn't that bad at all, in fact. And when you turn it up and you're kind of working out in the middle of them, you don't you start to not notice any latency issues where it's like, okay, this one is ahead of this one, or this one's behind this one, or whatever. It's just you got the music going, you're getting your workout on. I'm, I'm hitting the jump rope, you know, I'm getting to it. I even got closer to one of the speakers than the other, and I didn't really notice a difference at all. 
I was just, bam, 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 bam. You know what I'm saying? Jamming out to my, my uh, playlist. And I was like, okay, that's dope. Let me turn my way up. So I turned my way up. I went out the fitness center. Of course, I had my key card. Closed the door. You can hear him through the glass. No problem. I was like, okay, these are loud, loud. And only three watts. And I was like, okay. Okay. I'm impressed. I even picked them up. Both of them up. Did like this. I'll put it in the case. My bad. I had them both facing me. Did like this. And they are very, very strong. In fact, they are not bleeding. The highs are crisp enough for what these are supposed to do. But they're not going to make your ears bleed. So that's that's one thing that's super dope. So if you do have a kid, they put up, they, they might it might hurt their ear a little bit. But it's not going to be like, oh, you know, you're going to have an issue uh, at max volume. And I was like, okay, that's dope. They're, the sound is controlled. Three watts of output. 450 milliamp batteries. There's no clear indication on instructions how long the battery supposed to last. But so far, they're doing a pretty good job. I have yet to need to recharge these. Of course, it says IP. 67 watt up. Uh, of course, as you can see on the back, it does say waterproof level IP67. We know that's a water resistance level. It does come with a little protective flap for the USB. Let's pop that out. Which, when you put it in, you can feel it press on the USB to protect it. So that's pretty dope. I like that. I like that a lot. Now, what I suggest getting them. If you need a small set of speakers, something very portable, most definitely. Most definitely. Of course, I'm going to put them to the test. You know we got to put them against the incredible cannon. But that's one more test I got to do. You know what time it is. Let go. So, you know, you tell me you got an IP67 water resistance rating. I got to put it to the test. Shout out to OnePlus. Plug the sound. Let's turn the speakers on. Power on. Power on. First things first, let's fake facts. Let's take a moment to take you back. Back when I was in school and it wasn't cool to buy anything from black. Like, we always grown black folks just can't get along. I heard until I was grown, sick and tired of this song. Then I came up with the plan. Everybody would just laugh. Like, nigga, have you gone mad? Black business is equal trash. Fuck, uh, I can't believe this shit. Have me pissed and frustrated. I couldn't leave it alone. I had to make it known that I want to see it spread. Damn. I'm a ride, yes, I'm a ride. I'm a ride for my people. My people. How can I make this cool? At first, I did not have a clue, but I had to make a move. Let me take this to you too. I'm my channel, we just pop. On my grind, the world is stop. Took more than a couple of minutes in my channel monetized. I was on the road and it started to go slow. Almost gave up on my mission, but I could not let it go. No, my growth wasn't quick, but I stuck with this shit. Could have made some easy bread. I just wanna see it spin. Damn. I'm a ride, yes, I'm a ride. I'm a ride for a people. Oh, yeah. You know what it is. All right, family. As you can see, they held up to the test. We even submerged them underwater. We even do that with the Incredible Cannon. But we might do that with the Incredible Cannon when we do a head-to-head -head with these speakers. 
just to see how it holds up. But like I said, I'm impressed. They get loud. Y'all see he was pushing that water out of the grills. No problems, no issues. The LEDs are still on. And I like I said, I like the build quality and the little things that you see, like right there. The quality. Sound logo in the middle of the grill. That's super dope, super dope. Now, the only gripes I do have is the two separate cases. I wish it was one case. I can put them both in. There's a possibility to lose one or the other. You know how we are. We, we get clumsy. If you got kids, because you can pair them independent. Because you can pair them independently. One of your speakers might end up in one of their rooms. You got to beat your kid up with a pillow, of course. And you don't want to do that, all right? So that's one of my gripes. Micro USB. That is another gripe. We are on to the next generation of power and connectivity USB Type-C. Hopefully the next generation will have that. And one thing I would like to see from the next generation is not so much a um, skip tracks on here on the bottom, but maybe, maybe a slightly deeper shell for the speaker to get a little bit lower. I like lower bass. Punchy bass is, is dope. You know, you like to feel that, the, you know, the kick drum and all that stuff. I got that in my car, but it also gets low. And we all like when it get low. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Until next time, peace. And I say, and I promise you'll like these speakers. I put that on my mind. But no. Mama. But no. How are you even here? I'm 1,100 miles away. Because you thought I didn't hear you. Kinda. I'm not going to